Hey everyone, welcome to Simply Learn's YouTube channel. In this session, we will be learning about VStack in Excel. But before we begin, let me tell you guys that we have daily updates on multiple technologies. So, if you're a tech geek in a continuous hunt for latest technological trends, then consider getting subscribed to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit that bell icon to never miss an update from Simply Learn. Now, what exactly is VStack? So, let's get started with a practical mode. Now, we are on our Excel sheet. Here, you can see the employee names and employee IDs of different employees from different zones. Let us imagine that the blue one is from east, green one is from west, and the black one is from, or the purple one is from south, and the orange one is from north. So, this data is a little small, but what if we had a data with hundreds or thousands of rows including all the employee names, employee IDs, or another relevant data type like sales of an employee and his employee ID. And you are supposed to combine all the data from all the four different zones into one single sheet. It would consume a lot of time, right? So recently, Microsoft has released some latest updates based on arrays and datas. So one of those is VStack function in Excel. So how to use it? Since it is a latest function, I recommend you to go to the file menu and in the file menu, you can navigate to account and in the account, you can see the option of update options. Then you can select update now and your Microsoft Office will be updated to the latest version and you'll get access to the latest functions in Excel and all the other Office related things like PowerPoint presentation, etc. Now, we are going to implement the VStack function in Excel. It is completely simple. All you need to do is equals to stack and then select the data. Remember to select the data from column A and cell 2 or the row 2. We are not selecting the employee name and employee ID. We are just selecting the data. Now separate them by comma. Then again, this one here, this set and again, this one. And again, lastly, this particular last set. Now close the bracket and press enter. And there you go. You have all the employee names and their respective employee IDs all together in one data set. So this is how you use VStack function in Excel. And there are also a few more new updates from Microsoft Excel and we will discuss on them sooner. If you have any queries regarding any of the topics covered in this session or if you feel that we have missed out something important, do let us know in the comment section below and our team of experts will be more than happy to resolve all your queries at the earliest. Until next time, thank you, stay safe and keep learning. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.